hi leos welcome back to my channel so let's jump into your reading and see what messages the universe has for you this is going to be a bonus reading be sure to like comment and subscribe and click that notification bell so that when i upload readings you guys will be notified all right so we're gonna get four cards from this deck four from this deck and then we're gonna get some tarot so let's see we're gonna see why you and your person are going through these issues and why they're not speaking up on things and what your person could be thinking and feeling but not saying to you right now what messages do you have for leos what do they need to know for this bonus reading what does leos need to know for this bonus reading give me one second i tried to keep this card from falling on the floor that slipped right through my hands leo all right this card wanted to come out and this card wanted to come out and let's get one more give me one more for leo oh spirit said two more okay so instead of four you got five leo So we have, it gets harder each day to be in this relationship. So your person may be in a relationship with someone else. Or they may be talking about the relationship that they're in with you. But let's see where this is going. I'm starting to awaken to my true path. Everyone is in my ear about what I should do. That's making it harder to decide. Yeah, okay. So I feel like there's a decision here that this person needs to make between you and someone else. And it's getting harder for them to stay in this other relationship with this person. But I feel like people are telling, especially if they're married or if they've been living with this person for quite some time. Maybe they have children with them or they live in the same household. So they share the bills and things like that. And I feel like your person may be trying to get advice from people because it says everyone is in my ear about what I should do. That it's making it harder to decide. But this person is starting to awaken to their true path and what they want to do. I feel like this is someone who's starting to follow their heart because maybe they're in a loveless relationship at home and we're with you. That's where the love is. Oh, OK, I see. I depend on them too much to get ahead in life. We have the same social circle. It's hard to break free. So for some of you, Leo, what's happening with your person that they're not discussing and speaking up on things about is that they're trying to figure out how to break some sort of tie with someone. But it's like they have the same friends or maybe their family members are extremely close on both sides. And so it's going to get weird for everyone once they find out that they're walking away from that person to come towards you, the person that they love and want to be with. I think I want to pull. Let's get one more. Give me one more for Leo. What does Leo need to know about their person? Also, didn't I see, wait, what did I see here? Um, okay, here it is. I depend on them too much to get ahead in life. So this person needs to get their shit together first, or maybe this is what they're thinking before they can actually um, leave and come towards you and have a relationship with you because they depend on that person a lot. Yeah, we have, I have too much going on at work. I can't shake things up right now. So this person may have something that's um, causing them to put their attention on something related to their job or work. All right, let's get one more. I'm mad at myself for the choices I've made. Oh, Leo. All right. I don't know why the universe is saying keep pulling for you, but it's supposed to only be four. You got, you got about eight cards here, but it's okay. It's cool. I'm going to listen to my intuition and break up with them. Yeah. So this person is just trying to, to trust their intuition when it comes to the situation and what's the best thing for them to do. So it says I'm going to listen to my intuition and break up with this person. Now, I do feel, Leo, that this may take some time. This person may drag their feet because of everything that they possibly have going on right now. I feel like some of you know about this, um, that they, whatever they have going on, whether it's at work or just in the family, I feel like some of you know about it. Spirit, what messages do you have for Leo for this bonus reading? All right, so that's one. 
What does Leo need to know? Just, all right, so we have two. All right, some of you may hear. Um, if you guys hear the noise in the background, that's my ice maker being serviced. <laughs> so you may hear running water and ice flowing. Just ignore it. All right, so let's see. I hope it's not too distracting. All right, so we have three. Let's get one more. All right, so we have that one. All right, so we have dead end. This card signifies that there is no need to force the situation and or this is going nowhere at this moment. However, that doesn't mean things are over. Give it time. Be patient. So the universe is saying you may feel like this is a dead end with this person. Like this is going nowhere. You may be trying to figure maybe this is how some of you be like in the bed with your per with your partner. They're on their phone. You're on your phone. They could be talking to somebody else. You could be talking to someone else. Some of you right now feel like this is that, you know, it's at a dead end. Like, what are we going to do about this? And we have breakup. Time apart is on the horizon. This may be short term. And then we have Claire. Wait, yeah. Time apart is on the horizon. This may be short term. I just wanted to make sure I was reading that right. And then we have clarity. Someone finally sees the answer that was always right in front of their eyes. The vision is clear. Therefore, what is to come shall be clear as well. So some of you are going to get clarity on this relationship, where you and this person stand, and what's going to happen moving forward. And we have accountability. Someone needs to take accountability for their actions. It may be you, your partner, or both of you. Acknowledging the effect of your behaviors allows you to move forward. So you may wind up having a talk with your person where both of you, you know, talk about what the other person is doing and, and how to fix it and how to move forward, Leo. Or you've had, had this talk already and some of you may feel like, okay, well, I've already had this talk and look at her face. <laughs> some of y'all may feel like I already had this talk and I'm still not clear. We still got some issues here. I'm just looking at the cards. Yeah, some of you may be like, we did have a conversation on this and things are still going the way they're going. So like, what are we going to do about this? All right, so let's get some tarot. Some cards flying out already. Spirit messages do you have for Leos? We have the Two of Pentacles, the Four of Swords, Leo. Your cards are flying out of the deck, Leo. Leo. Some of you are dealing with a water sign, a Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio who's thinking about this connection so hard. I feel like you got them thinking. They underestimated your silence or they underestimated the moves that you're making. Because with the Two of Pentacles and the Four of Swords, this is someone who's like, well, wait a minute. Let's figure this out. Maybe this person is not ready to um to end this connection with you maybe they feel like this can be worked out i feel like you're not talking somebody's not speaking or saying anything here somebody's being really silent spirit what messages do you have for leos yep and here's the knight of cups so somebody may come in either trying to apologize to you because they're feeling emotional about the situation because we have the knight of cups and the king of cups so this is a Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio, or your person is just feeling extremely emotional. And it may be something that they're thinking about that they're not even telling you. With the Two of Pentacles and the Four of Swords, they're trying to balance out something here when it comes to making a choice between either you and another person or just their life in general. Yeah, we have the Ace of Swords. So we have clarity here twice. So you're definitely going to get clarity on something here. Something's going to be made very clear to you so that either you can make a decision or your person can make a decision or y'all are going to make this decision together. So I feel like your person is not speaking up on the fact that um, they're actually trying to move away from someone, but people are in their ears with, you know, their opinions and their advice. And I feel like it's confusing them. It's confusing your person. Spirit messages do you have for Leos? The Three of Swords. 
somebody knows that this is hurting you and they want to make you happy because this person is attached to you. Yeah, look at the cards we have. We have the Six of Wands, the Devil. Some of you could be dealing with the Capricorn. We also have the High Priestess. So we have Pisces energy and the Nine of Cups. You make this person happy. It doesn't matter if you guys argue or what you go through. Somebody is also seeking redemption, basically. They want forgiveness. They want to rise above these problems that you guys are having. They want to improve the situation and heal from whatever it is that they did to you or whatever it is you guys are going through with the Three of Swords and the Ten of Swords reversed. Also, I'm sort of picking up the energy that some of you are holding back on this person, but you haven't really left the connection. You're just trying to see... Um, I'm not picking up manipulation on your end. I'm not. I'm picking up the energy of Leo. Maybe you're like, well, let me go silent. Let me hold back and let me see what happens from this point. Because you're like, I don't know what else to do about this. Maybe you feel like you've done all that you could do. You said all that you could say and there's nothing else to say or do. So maybe you're waiting for this person to fix this. What messages do you have for Leo? That card just flipped in a circle. What is this? Yep. The will of fortune. And here's the change. Here's the change. Here's the turning point. So the universe is letting you know there will be a change and there will be a turning point with your person. Um, this could be a fixed sign. Leo is a fixed sign. So some of you could be dealing with another Leo or you could be creating your own change by um, whatever behavior and actions that you're taking we also have aquarius fixed sign scorpio and taurus all right so let's get one more give me one more for leo some of you are dealing with the king of swords here you're heavy on this person's mind yep knight of swords page of pentacles so this is somebody who's watching you this person may try to come in and start an argument with you with that knight of swords I don't feel like it's their, um, I don't feel like this is what they're trying to do, Leo. I just feel like it's going to happen because you guys are going to be discussing something. But they're not, they're not trying to leave. They're not trying to walk away. Because the Seven of Pentacles is here. So how this King of Swords is looking at the situation is that they're already invested. So maybe you're telling them you're walking away and they're like, well, wait, hold up. Like, it's done. It's over. Like, I thought we were going to work on things. Because I see an offer coming in with the Page of Pentacles. Somebody is telling you, like, they're coming up with some sort of plan. They're like, okay, this is what we can do. We can work on this. Let me still give to this. And you may look at it like you're giving to this as the Page of Pentacles, so you're really not giving enough. And you may look at it like I'm the only one that's giving to this situation right now. And so I feel like this person may look at it like, okay, I need to make some changes. So with this Wheel of Fortune coming out, I see... Um, for And also... Leo, I have to say there's good fortune coming in. So something that you're working on is going to take shape like really fast. Some sort of abundance. Um, something here with this will of fortune. So there's a lot of change coming your way. And maybe you're pulling your energy away from this situation and this person right now so that you can work on something else. But it's getting their attention because the page of swords is here. So this is someone who is looking in on you just to see what you have going on. They're possibly watching your social media. Also, I find sometime with the Page of Swords, they may be reading old text messages. Like just say if you sent this person a lot of text messages and they didn't actually go through it and read it, but it's still on their phone. I feel like this person may be trying to um, now read these text messages and decipher what you were trying to say to them, what you were trying to get them to understand. All right, one more. Let's get one more. Give me one more for Leo. The full card. All right, so some of you, yeah, something's not ending here. The world is reversed and the fool is in the upright. So there is a, there's either going to be a new beginning between you and someone, Leo, or um, you're dealing with an Aries or you're going in a different direction. And so you're getting somebody's attention. It's a Scorpio energy. Some of you could be dealing with a Scorpio or an Aries. But um, this is sort of like the cycle is not ending here. 
And so you guys may be deciding to continue this relationship with someone. Maybe you're taking a break for now until this person figures out their situation. But don't forget, you guys got this. We have the same social circle. It's hard to break free. And they're also listening to their intuition. And they're going to break up with this person or this is their plan. But it may be hard because of all this all these opinions and advice that they're getting from friends or family so it's sort of making it difficult for your person so those are the messages that i have for your reading leos thank you for watching my channel and i will see you guys in the next video bye